But did you know that the largest Wall Street investors are also responsible for the climate crisis? the planetary emergency that might cost us all the only home we have. BlackRock, the world's largest investors, poured billions into projects and companies that are destroying the planet. From oil drilling in the Arctic, to coal power plants in India, to palm oil plantations in Liberia, BlackRock is fueling climate disaster around the world. BlackRock CEO Larry Fink wants to portray himself as a model corporate citizen. In his annual investor letters, Fink pretends to call on companies to serve a social purpose and to make a positive contribution to society. But this is pure hypocrisy. In reality, BlackRock is the largest global investor in new coal plant development and in oil and gas companies, and one of the largest investors in rainforest destruction. Larry Fink has no business lecturing others while his company is driving us to the brink of ecological collapse. The window for solving the climate crisis is closing. Scientists give us less than 12 years. If we want to mitigate the impacts of extreme floods, droughts, and wildfires, we can't continue burning fossil fuels, wiping out forests, and releasing carbon pollution into the atmosphere. That means taking on the greed of the fossil fuel industry and its financial backers like BlackRock and other Wall Street giants. We cannot allow these investors to wreck our planet for short-term profits. The second largest contributor to global warming is the destruction of the world's forests. International companies producing beef, soy, paper, and palm oil are cutting down the world's last forests displacing indigenous communities and driving wildlife to extinction, all with the financial backing of BlackRock and other massive Wall Street investors. Last month, environmental activists descended on BlackRock's annual general meeting with a simple message. Stop financing the climate crisis and phase out investments in fossil fuel companies and agribusinesses that are destroying the planet. BlackRock markets its hypocrisy through so-called sustainable funds that in reality have hundreds of millions invested in coal, oil, gas, and deforestation. Instead of making a mockery of sustainability, BlackRock and Wall Street need to put their money where their mouth is. Nothing short of a massive reallocation of capital away from polluting industries will do.